Good morning, everybody. Um, Val's not going to be in the good morning today. Hopefully, she'll be feeling better by the end of the day. She woke up very nauseous. So, I gave her something for her stomach and put her back to sleep. Today, I'm on my way back to uh, my mom's house to finish the, the work I was doing in her bathroom. And... Uh, don't know how long that's going to take, but uh, I will bring you guys. I know how much you love that, so I'll bring you guys along. Let's see how I do. All right, so I'll see you there. Okay, so here I am back in the bathroom, and I got the toilet off over here and apart. And here's my dilemma. This is what's been going on. I have the, uh, the toilet bowl, and it's supposed to just go into this slot. It's a key slot, and it'll hold it to uh, hold the toilet down. It should need a lot of, of uh, strain on it because you don't want to put too much because you'll break the porcelain. However, this is so chewed up and so broken that no matter what I did and what position I had it in, it was not going to stay. Last time I was here, I thought this was going to be the, uh, the answer. But uh, because it should hold it all together, but it doesn't. It uh, uh, it's not strong enough to hold the bolt by itself, and um, the plastic is so chewed up that it just popped out. And uh, yeah, so that didn't work. So this is my next solution. This is uh, another piece of metal that's keyed. And I am going to put it underneath the flange and um, bolt it straight to the floor. And uh, this will key into that and it's going to hold for sure. I just got to make sure that this is in a proper location before I tighten it all down. And that should be the end of it. Put the seal in. It's a wax seal. I've already, I've already destroyed one because these, uh, you can only use them once. It's just wax. So, here we go. Mm -hmm. So still not working. So I got this side. This is the side that I was having so much trouble tying down. It's awesome now. When is it working? Well, this side is now pulling out. Oh, okay. So that means getting that same floor attachment that I did for this side. Mm -hmm. uh, and this seal mm -hmm. in between the, the bowl and the tank oh. is shot. So it's leaking. Oh, okay. So, Maybe I need a new toilet. Well, the toilet's fine. It's just that everything attached to it is junk. Oh, okay. So the what really needs to happen, of course, is you should have the um, all that plumbing removed underneath and replaced. But we're not going to do that. No, we so, don't have time it, to do see, that. See, it's all leaking still. Got water here. Oh. So. So why is it, if you have flushed it, why is it leaking? It's still got water in it. Oh, okay. The only way I'm going to get all the water out is to pull the toilet again. Yeah, okay. It's got a pee trap in there that keeps the water in there. And okay. the, having the water in there is good because then the, these gases won't come out of the sewer. Yeah. So that's why it's there. Okay. All right, that was round two on my mother's toilet and it's still not working. Uh, I done the same thing before with my mom's toilet and we always end up with the same problem and all I could think of is um, the wax ring that cup that goes into it doesn't fit into a three inch and it always jacks up the toilet it doesn't go into the 
pipe. So that's what I, I ran into both times. And then trying to over tighten it to get it to seal anyway. So the last time I just got a, uh, a wax sealed with just the wax and without the cup. And I kind of remember that's what I did last time. And um, then it put the uh, bolt pulled out on the other side. So the side that I had repaired works great. So I'm going to have to do that again on this side. My biggest concern, of course, is now I'm adding about a sixteenth of an inch of steel underneath the flange on both sides. And is that making my flange cup? So the flange really needs to be replaced. But I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm, that is a huge undertaking. I have to. I would have to cut out all that plumbing underneath the house and replace it in one day because um, all of her plumbing goes out through there. So I'm not going to be able to do that. Fun. Okay, so I took a shower, which I think I needed after that. And um, Val's still not feeling well. She's asleep. So uh, this is it for today. Uh, I'm going to not work on the toilet tomorrow. I'm getting tired of working on this thing. But um, basically the flange is so tore up that once I got one side working, the other side broke. So, and, uh, so I got to do the same thing to the other side. Hopefully it won't take too long. And... Uh, so uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Don't uh, forget to give us a thumbs up, share, and leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Mm -hmm.